I'm gonna turn it, hey, don't worry, come to the Christmas jingle party. I'll have a song by then. Looking for it, mix it up, but um, no. So everybody wants to know about March 26 and you know stuff like that, where it comes to timing. Your I mean, things are different timing and why it is, you know, like I say, my God hates ugly. You know, it, it, it really means a different thing. So it comes to that day. And nothing had ever been said. I don't know if anybody's if you read my book or see the story or heard me talk about it. But no one's ever thought I'm right. I fucking right. I love it. I love it. I love my, my train. Right. So anyways, so that day it never been talked about, um, you know, like the drapes or shanty, anything. And the way that it happened, that Igor Larionov and Peter Forsberg started it. So you had like Russia at, like Sweden was like Popping off like one of those like when and then when those neutral countries pop off, it's sort of like politics, right? So the Russians get involved and it's Igor and God dang young lady, you might be bigger than Igor. Seriously, like he's I mean you might be. I mean you're not saying that you're big at all, but I mean it's like you get my point. So he's a very slight professor. Anyway, they start going and then it hangs out and I know the muse on the ice and and I'm zeroing in and foot's got a hold of me and Shani comes in and breaks it just like, you know, like a movie and I lean up and this is where I teach you the difference between a sucker punch and a cold cock. <laughs> if the person is facing this way and you're coming from this way and you hit him, well, that's not nice, that's a sucker punch, right? That's a sucker punch. But if you pop out of a pod and you look them in the eyes and they see you and you fucking drill it right down their fucking face, and you fucking hit them so hard that you say that they were not going to And then you get on top of them and you fucking, you're so mad if you look in that picture that I pop veins in my hand. Because I literally, it's a good thing I wasn't smart enough, to, or stupid enough, I should say, at the time to stick my skate through its face. Because I would have done that. Instead, knowing or not knowing, allegedly, I might have known the, the president of Comerica Bank. Which the sign was on the board, and I smacked his face right into that sign. It actually was in the president of Comerica Parks, off uh, Comerica's <laughs> office, with the blood, Lemieux blood splatter on it. But yeah. the fact that it went yeah. kind of great was the omen. But that's because my God hates ugly, right? And the fact that, that the great thing of the whole game, I got four minutes for roughing and a ten minute misconduct, and I scored the overtime winner. Come on, give me a fuck, Andy. Which, which 